Two and a half billion people worldwide do not have access to safe and affordable sanitation. A flush toilet is not an option for many of the regions that need sanitation the most. We need new ways to treat human waste. Scion and scientists from all over the world are working with the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation to reinvent the toilet. Crown Research Institute Scion's campus in Rotorua is an unlikely place to find a $2 million experimental toilet. Hi, I'm Rob Whitten and I'm a mechanical engineer in the Clean Tech team. Uh, we've been producing a toilet unit for the Reinvent the Toilet Challenge, uh, so let me show you what we've done. The equipment's mounted on a platform so we can move it around and show it off. Now this is where the process starts. It's a vacuum toilet similar to what's found on an airplane. The advantage of using a vacuum toilet is that it uses a low volume of flush water. This piece of equipment is the macerator pump. It provides the vacuum that sucks the waste from the toilet. It then macerates the waste and pumps the waste into the holding tank. The reason we macerate the waste is to reduce its particle size and to improve its consistency for pumping. Once the waste arrives in the holding tank, it can be stored for a short period of time before it's pumped to the reactor. A specific volume of waste is pumped into the reactor. The process is a batch process, so the reactor will be run several times a day to process the day's waste. We process the waste at high pressure and high temperature until we see a change. What's produced by the reactor is a relatively clear liquor with no suspended solids in it other than inert ash. This is the PSA unit. Um, it takes uh, oxygen from the air um, and concentrates it to provide a high purity oxygen supply. Um, it's stored in this bottle here at high pressure uh, which we can then use to feed the reactor um, when it's required. Once the reaction's complete, the heating and oscillation stop. The liquid is driven out of the reactor under its own pressure into the blowdown tank where it rapidly expands and cools. The next step is to pump the liquor to the polishing stage holding tank where it can be stored before it's sent on to the polishing stage. The polishing stage removes dissolved compounds so that the liquid is safe for discharge. One polishing technology that's currently being developed by Scion is the use of purple phototrophic bacteria to convert dissolved compounds into useful biomass. Our vision is to produce a system that is easy to transport and install and that will bring safe sanitation to those who need it. Our final prototype will be more compact, which will enable it to be installed in a household. For more information, visit our website, www.scionresearch.com.